It's 6.45 in the morning. It is Tuesday, October 11th. And I have no idea what I'm doing. So I promised myself uh, that today, October 11th, I would start what was gonna be 30 days of a daily video blog. Now, why the hell would I do such a thing? Uh, a couple reasons. Uh, one, this is an opportunity for me to have something every single day, no matter what's going on, no matter where I am, no matter what I'm doing. Uh, this is gonna give me an opportunity to create something. So that's one. Uh, number two uh, is the discipline. Forcing myself uh, to do something every single day, no matter what I do, no matter what uh, I am, where I am, what I'm doing. Third, um, I watched a video, uh, I was inspired, I think, uh, by, by someone who, who's doing this, you know, better than I think anyone's going to be able to do this, better than anyone ever has done this, and that's Casey Neistat. She said, you know, if I didn't have this daily video blog to shoot, record, edit, you know, there's days where I just wouldn't do anything. You know, there's days where it was easy to say, look, I'll just take it easy today. Uh, you know, I'll, I'll relax, I won't go out, I won't do this, I won't do that. Is it having to produce something every single day, uh, showing people what you're doing, uh, it forces you to create new experiences. It forces you to get out and meet people. It forces you to find interesting, exciting things to do. And I think for a lot of us, I know for me in particular, uh, it, you know, I've got days where I've got really cool, exciting things happening, but I've got days where I just avoid going out and doing those things that I really should be doing. You've got really limited time here on this earth, um, really limited. Average days alive on earth. It's 27,315 days. That's it. Uh, it. Might seem like a big number, but it's not. Uh, we've heard it over and over again, make every day count, but the reality is, um, it's really all we got. So that's what this blog is gonna be about. Um, there's no theme, there's nothing specific. I'm just really trying to take in as many possible experiences as I can, uh, document them as much as I can, as best I can every single day, and make that pledge to myself that every single night uh, or every single morning, the next day before the world wakes up, uh, I'm gonna have something to produce, something that I've created, something that I can share. Uh, it's 6.45 a.m., I am tired, I haven't showered. This is it. This is what we're going to try to do. So $48,000 is the exact amount that you have to owe to get kicked out of the tannery. It's probably the biggest box. Yeah, there we go. That. They don't even wrap this up. What if it was something embarrassing? What if you bought something on Amazon and it was embarrassing and they shipped it like that? Like that? Yeah. Good thing it's no, a coffee maker. It could have been, could have, that that could have been a lot worse. I think you, you have to write it. The question I have for both of you two is if Amazon is now shipping products like this with no box and you buy something embarrassing from Amazon and they ship it to your work, can you sue Amazon? Like they just shipped it like this. Like no, no, I'm not embarrassed. I'm just saying what if I had bought something else. Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn. If you're uh, looking for the spot 
in Kitchener, Waterloo, we're most likely uh, to get attacked by a clown. We're getting pretty close. Look at this little gem. Another place you could get attacked by a clown in Kitchener. Next up on top places you could get attacked by a clown. <laughs> Check this out. Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn. Officially halfway point of this 10K run. Little scenery behind us here. No, no clown attacks. Uh, no dog attack. Almost one dog attack. Uh Film capturing it right. Like sometimes right. it digitally just stops. Right. What's your band name? Uh, Monarch Woods. Oh, <laughs> yes. Oh, my God. Seriously. <laughs> yeah. This is a band that. called Monarch Woods shooting their music video. And I'm just looking for a red light. This, yeah, you tell me what okay. looks good. Yeah, yeah, I'm just getting focused here. Yeah. This on, yeah. You good? Yeah. Go for the rest of the team here. Yeah, yeah. All right, have a good one, guys. Yeah, see ya. Yeah, see ya. We are nowhere near Bingham's. Give a damn. 